Hello everyone and welcome back to the 2017 Club World Cup. The first match that will be played today will determine the fifth placed club in this competition. The losing teams in the quarterfinals are facing each other in this match for uh, the last chance to achieve at least a uh, minimum objective. Similar scoreline in both quarterfinals that uh, these two teams have played. Urawa Red Diamonds have been defeated by Al Jazeera and White Dad by Patrick after extra time. Here are the starting lineups La Ruby in goal for uh, White Dad, Atucci in defense, Al Kart in the midfield, Dao and Bechaki in attack. On the other side, the Japanese team with Ishikawa in goal. Endo and Abe in defense, Yajima and Kashiwaji in the midfield, Kuroki in attack. Ready for kickoff. And the referee blows his whistle. Why that gets us on the way in the match? Rabe with the ball. We pass to Najim. McCarty to Kadruf. Headed away by Makino. Yajima. Advancing. We'll pass to Muto. To Makino, a great pass on the left side in the box. It's saved by the goalkeeper and they have to get it away from there as soon as possible. Rabe with the ball. Pass it to Nusir. Druff to Alcarti. ID to Nusir. Druff again. ID. Nusir gets it on the right. I'm trying to advance on that side. And it's quite busy with uh, Euro Red defenders. A breakthrough maybe now. Here's the cross. And it's headed away. Get it to Kokori, but he's quite isolated up there. Muto to Makino. Good control and pass it to Yajima. Kashiwaji to Kokori. Ships it on the left to Muto. Tries to cross, and it's going to be a corner kick for the Japanese team. Unlike the matches being played until now, uh, for this one, extra time will not be played in case of a tie at the end of the 90 minutes. Instead, the two teams will go straight to the penalty shootout. Make things a bit more interesting. Ball gets to Daho, gets it back to Ben Charki. Toro to Ben Charki has to cross from there. There it is. He chose to pass instead of heading it, maybe he didn't reach the ball in time to head it, but I think he had time to prepare a shot there anyway you're all red diamonds on the attack now, Kokori trying to hang on the ball, he does well he gets it back, a pass to Kashiwaji has to take the shot from there and it's blocked Daho Elkarti to Bencharki tackled and dispossessed by Oki Silva Kokori to Muto advances on the left tries to get in the box he gets back on the ball a shot and a goal two minutes before half time Kuroki opens the scoring They've had their opponents under continuous pressure. Yes, uh, very well placed shot and right next to the penalty spot.
Not a very pleasant time to concede. Right before half time, but a well thought out talk by the manager at the break could motivate them for the second half and try to equalize at least. So there it is 1 0 for Euro Red Diamonds at the break. It's going to be an interesting second part. Back for the second half of the match between White Dad and Urawa Reds. The fifth place playoff match at the 2017 Club World Cup. Here's a great pass to Karaki. Takes the shot and it's saved by the goalkeeper. Did very, very well this time to stop it. But again, constantly attacking and the second half has just begun. Great job by the goalkeeper. They get a corner kick. It's going to be taken by Abe. Cross! Oh, he tried to go with an overhead kick. And another deflected shot for another corner. And it is chest there. Let's see Abe crossing from the right. Awkwardly headed away. Now things calm down for a bit. Dao gets the ball. And the gem. A good pass to Bencharki. Needs teammates to help him there. Tried to cross it, but he was tackled there and lost his balance. Silva. Gajin. Silva asking for a pass, there it is, could take a shot from there, not anymore, but he passes it to his teammates and he's lucky, oh well, I thought they got lucky, turned out it wasn't so, <laughs> the ball got to one of their defenders but it bounced right back to Karaki. have to analyze this in the replay let's see great pass here Silva could have taken the shot from there if he reached the ball earlier but it turned around passed it very well oh no it was uh, an attempted clearance but oh, that was just terrible absolutely terrible give it right back to him and he just got back up and took the shot 2-0 and this is also a way to lose a match Mistakes made by defenders. 30 minutes left. Uh, we've seen bigger comebacks before. They have plenty of time to equalize at least. But they have to focus a little harder. They're attacking now. And it comes to a stop. And a jump to Rabek. Lukati to Saidi. Dealt with that very well. Karaki with the ball. Great dribbling. Passing Makino. Kashiraji to Silva. Chip ball for Karaki. This time they've done much better to stop the attack. Playing another long ball. Oh, do Got close to getting the ball back there. Silva looking for teammates. A great pass to Karaki. Yajima gets it on the right. Silva. Yajima again. And he's tackled very well by Onochem. Now Bencharki. Tao. And again. He's trying to advance. Lacking speed in their attacks. As we can see, and uh, can't make much of the time they have the ball. Look at this. Almost dispossessed now. <laughs> it actually happened. Kuroki with the ball in the midfield. Kashiraji. Through ball. 
across the header. Misplaced. 2 0 or 3 0 really doesn't make much of a difference. It's still going to be a win. And um, he's not going to lose sleep over this tonight, obviously. Time for some changes, very late though. See one minute added on the end. I think it's settled. Euro Reds are going to win this match. There's the referee's final whistle. 2 0 win for the Japanese team as a result of this simulation. Thank you for watching and check back in in a few hours for the first semi final between Gremio and Pachuca.